Hi guys, thanks for joining me today. Today's video is going to be about a few products that I love and going to recommend and one product that I didn't like. Um, so yes, I'm going to get started. So the first thing I'm going to recommend to you is the Sheer Glow Daily Moisturizer. And I picked this up from Rite Aid. Well, actually, I didn't pick this up. I was with my husband when he picked it up. Um, this is a daily moisturizer. It has a little bit of gold reflex in it to give your complexion a very, like, glowy look, especially during the summer months. Now, this product does make you tan because it says medium skin tone. And it tells you in the back, like if you're very fair and you like to get a little bit of a tan, I don't particularly like to tan, um, it'll tell you the grades of color that you can get from being very light to maybe a, about my complexion, maybe. Um, my husband is a rich, a rich brown color. He's a little bit darker than me. And the reason why I'm recommending this, because I have been using this for the last two weeks, this is his. This made his darker brown skin look so beautiful, so smooth, so soft, and he had a, a nice glow. Now the glow comes from the soft reflex that's in it, but like the gold re reflex, it comes from that also, but it just made his skin just look smooth and his skin felt smooth and soft. So I really like using this. I got um, I, I got this from the car, this is his, and because uh, I tend to use it when I'm in the car. And uh, yeah, so this is really nice. This is from Rite Aid. I don't remember how much it costs. I think maybe it costs maybe, I would say under $7. The tube is really nice and big. As you can see, it's a nice big tube. And uh, it says, create a healthy moisturizing glow all year long. So my next product, this is by Organics. Now last week, I showed you two products by Organics. It was the hydrating and defrizzing Kukui oil conditioner and then the curl cream I showed you that I went back and I picked up the this is the hydrating oil anti anti frizz hydrating oil and this just this works really well guys I like this a lot this just moisturizes the hair very nicely without making it feel oily greasy or weighed down and it gives it a bit of a shine and what I like about this also I've been like kind of spritzing it on my hands just to hydrate my hands. It's a momentary hydration for the hands, but it seems like it, it's a lasting hydration feel and look on your hair. So, yeah, so I recommend this. This is the Organics Hydrate Defrizz Kukui Oil Anti-Freeze Hydrating Oil. And this is not greasy at all. It's not greasy or oily feeling at all. My next product I want to recommend I really like this I picked this up at the beauty supply store and it was a eyeshadow palette by Princessa and here are the colors and I'll swatch these for you at another time uh, guys I really love the colors in this palette this is like a neutral palette very nude colors we have pinks and tans golden colors we also have this really light color here for highlighting either the inner corner of your eye or you can maybe highlight the highest point in your brow. This was a really nice palette. It was really inexpensive. I think, again, this was $2.99. The eyeshadows did not irritate my eyes, which is a plus. Um, most eyeshadows irritate my eyes if I don't use a base. And um, this didn't irritate my eyes without a base, so I really like this. This isn't heavily pigmented. But it gives you just the right amount of color, especially if you want to wear eyeshadows for the daytime, but you're afraid of the intense color that you may get when you apply your shadows. This works really well for that. It doesn't deposit a lot of color, but it does have a beautiful finish. So my next product that I picked up was, I think, January 1st. And I, I, my husband and I went out to Target. It was in the evening just to see what they had left after all the Christmas and New Year's madness. And I picked this up there. This was a full selection of Miss Jessie's products there. This is the Pillow Soft Curl. And I bought this and I never used it. Well, I used it for the first time last night on my hair. Now, my hair today is a wig that I made. And this is a full cap wig. And the hair is by Marlena Moan. And I think this curl pattern is called the Valentina Romantic Sea Curl. To bring the curls back because after I made the wig, I washed it. And then I used this product. And this really just helped 
just create a nice um, wavy texture to your hair. You don't have to do any special thing with rotting or curling. You don't need to do that at all. This says this is the best darn super soft styling lotion. And it's called Pillow Soft Curls. Now, I like the texture of it. It's kind of like a cream gel in a way. But the one thing that's interesting about this product, to me anyway, is that it so mysteriously smells like downy fabric softener. And it smelled like that very much to me that I refused to use this product after I got it in January. I waited till the next time I ran into this product, which was in the beauty supply store. I asked the shop owner, could I see it, could I smell it? And his also smelled like um, downy fabric softener. So at least I felt at that point I wasn't like getting some strange product that someone was making up in the back rooms in Target. But uh, yeah, so anyway, this is a great product for reviving curls, for creating curls. If you already have like wavy hair or curly hair of this type, this definitely helps just redefine the curl and it doesn't feel stiff, or firm, or anything like that. It feels very soft. Just the way you see me just playing with it, this hair is so soft. And I'll get, again, this is Miss Jessie's Pillow Soft Curl. This product is called the Supernatural Airbrush Canvas. This is by Philosophy. And I absolutely love Philosophy Airbrush Foundation. Uh, it comes, this is the original packaging. This is the way it used to come. And you take this off and then you just sort of buff the minerals into your skin and it gives you a very soft, glowy look. Now this color that I'm showing you now is called Extra Rich. And I, I use it in rich. It's a, a little bit lighter. It's more of a perfect color for me. This is a little too dark. I tend to use this one as a like bronzer in a way or a blush. But anyway, this is the original packaging if you, if you know the product. And if you wanted to, you can always just take the lid off. Let me see if I can take the lid off. Take the lid off and then you can just use your product from by dipping a little bit of your brush in there, tapping it off, and then swirling. You can use it like that. I've done that also. But the best way to use this product is to just use it straight from the applicator sponge and you just buff it in. So now the product as I as we know it no longer exists. This they stopped making it this way. And this is what the product looks like now. And I kept the box because I think I wanted to send it back, but I'm not sure yet. So now it's in a bigger packaging, just like this. This is, again, it says the Supernatural Airbrush Canvas. This is the mineral foundation again. And now this is how you apply it. It has a big brush that's just loaded, loaded, loaded with powder. And I've tried tapping it off, the excess back into the container. But the problem is there's so much powder trapped in the brush that you're still going to deposit a lot of foundation onto your face. I mean, this is really just, I mean, I really don't like this. I was so, so disappointed. Not to mention the color is so much lighter than my color, the rich color that I use. This color is called Honey. And there's another color that's a little bit deeper, but I don't think it's deep enough for me. So, I mean, this was really just like a, a miss for me. My, my color that they make is no longer available. And so what I've been doing now is just going on to eBay and any place where I can find the original Airbrush Canvas Mineral Foundation. If I can find it in my color, I'm just gonna buy it as many as I can find. And uh, yeah, so again, this was my miss. This was a miss, a big miss. The Supernatural Airbrush Canvas Mineral Foundation by Philosophy. This is not for me, guys. This is just, this is just not for me. Now, I guess I can always take this and tap it onto another uh, dish or another, you know, palette. But I don't want to go through that every morning using this. I just want to just pick up my foundation, take the cap off, and then just apply it. So... This is definitely a miss for philosophy. I wish they'd bring back the old foundation and the old foundation applicators. I love it. I even went to the 
point where I found the replaceable sponges. So I have my sponges and now I'm just waiting for my foundation to come. And so anyway, that's it guys. Supernatural Airbrush Canvas Mineral Foundation by Philosophy. Thumbs down. I don't like it. So guys, that's it. That was just a few things that I bought you today. Um, the other things I love a lot, I recommend them if you can find them, pick them up. And uh, yeah, so guys, thank you so much for joining me. I appreciate it. Welcome to all my new subscribers and welcome to all my old subscribers, guys. Thank you all for sticking with me and, and thank you for your support. And thank you for all the wonderful comments that you leave in the comment section. I appreciate it so much. And um, so that is it, I think, for now. So you take care and be well, and I will see you at the next video. Bye-bye.